this is Mr. O, and you join me at the top, nearly at the top of Taimo Shan. I have a beautiful view all over the Yunlong area in this direction, and the Chunwan, Qingyi area in this direction. I don't know if you can see that, it's quite a misty day today. Anyway, I'm gonna show you a few shots of uh, my walk that I took, some interesting things, and also I'm going to read messages with cats. Here we go. So I've got my cat here, got one here, the other one just over there, out of shot. And I have got lots and lots of messages from you. I've got lots and lots of messages uh, from you guys. Thank you if you wrote me a message. So let's have a look. Uh, this first one is from Casper. Casper says, Hello, I am Casper. Hello, Casper. Do you remember me? Yes, Casper. I remember you. I remember you very, very well. And I'm very happy that you sent me a message. Um, Casper actually is in a Mr. O video. His voice, he is the boy that says, Pew, 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 yeah, pew, pew. I started that pew, pew, <laughs> pew. That's Casper. So thank you, Casper, for your message. What do you want? I don't want to fight with you. No. I'm reading messages. All right. Next, this one is from, well, he said I should use his initials. So this one is from JT. JT says, hi, Mr. O. Hi, JT. Did you know that I like Star Wars too? Mm, I don't remember, but I know now. Also, can you teach me how to make those special effects when you make your videos? Well, I can do. There's uh, two Star Wars effects in my videos, if you watch closely. One of them is in uh, the Tuck Shop um, video number three. And the other one is in my Jenga video. And Jedi Jenga, where you have to use the Force. They take quite a long time to do these special effects. And uh, can I teach you? Well, I did make a video about how I did these special effects. So JT, maybe you can watch that video and tell me if you can do it yourself. Next message <clears throat> is from another old student of mine. Uh, this person says I can use their initials. So this is a message from KS. KS says, guess what IDK, what can I ask you? Ah, I think it's, guess what? IDK, what I can ask you, or I don't know what I can ask you. But uh, anyway, it says, uh, one, why did you start your YouTube channel? Well, I started my YouTube channel because I wanted to make songs and I wanted uh, the students to listen to them and share them. The first song that I made was called The Months of the Year. January, February, March, April, May, June. And uh, after that I made a song uh, called Did You, it's the past tense song. Did you come to school? Yes, I came to school. Did you see a teacher? Yes, 
I saw my teacher. This song is actually my most popular video. It gets hundreds of views um, every week. I don't know why, but anyway, people seem to still like it, which is nice. So uh, you can watch both of those videos um, if you want to. Uh, I will put a link at the bottom and in the description. Yes, I will. Next, this one is from Sonia Wong. Hello, Sonia, again. Sonia sends me messages from time to time. I'm very happy about that. Uh, we also had a photo together um, a few weeks ago. So she said, I saw your video, Mr. O Vlogs in Kings Park. And I want to tell you that my favourite park in Hong Kong is Kowloon Walled City Park. That is an excellent choice. I love Kowloon Walled City Park. It's big, not too many people in it. There's lots of levels. It goes up a hill. It's got some beautiful, like, chinese uh, parts to it. It's a really, really nice park. I, if you've never been there, I really recommend you go there when it's safe to go out again. Hashtag coronavirus. So thank you, Sonia, for your message. This next one is from somebody. They want me to use their initials. If you want to send me a message, I won't read your name out if you don't want me to. Um, I can use your initials and that's what this person wants. He sent me a few uh, messages, three messages. So thank you. This person is called W. So W uh, asks, why in the home are you still wearing the mask? Maybe let's change that to, why are you still wearing a mask at home? Uh, just to be silly and also to show you how important it is. Uh, next message. Now I know how to play it. Mr. O, where do you buy this game? I think that this one, this message is either about Shut the Box or Leo Goes to the Barber. Shut the Box I bought in Thailand. Um, Leo Goes to the Barber, I bought it from Amazon. Now don't start bugging your parents about buying you lots of toys and games, okay? But yeah, Amazon or other places. Uh, last message from W, he says, are you teaching me how to wash hands? Yes, I was teaching you that. And are you playing with washing the hands? You because I see you in YouTube, you love playing the bubbles. The idea is that if you're playing with bubbles, then you're washing your hands for longer. And that's what we all need to do, is to try and make hand washing less boring. I think everybody loves playing with bubbles, right? Everybody loves bubbles. So, yeah. Next, this one is from somebody called, well, I don't think this is from a student. They say, hi there. Buy all models of Gucci belts, only $19.99. Please check our site. No, I won't, because I don't believe that you're really selling Gucci belts, and I don't want one anyway. Next, this message is from Ella Chan. Ella uh, was my student before. She says, uh, Dear Mr. O, hello, my name is Ella. I'm your student before. I was your student before. Yes, Ella, I remember you. Thanks for telling me that it is not a piece of mask, but it is a mask from Ella. Yes, you're quite right and uh, well done for remembering that. Next, dear Mr. O, Mr. O, if you have time, I want to introduce you to this cartoon. It is called Shinka Lion, Shinka Lion, Shinka, 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 Shinka Lion? Shinka, sh it already have movie, so there is already a movie of it, and I can watch it. So thank you, Ella, for your lovely messages. This next one is from Trevor Choi, or as I used to call him, Big Trevy Trev, the Trevmeister. Uh, hey, I remember you from the speech, and I love your vids, and you're an awesome teacher. 
Hmm. Hey, I remember you from the speech. Speech festival? And I love your vids. Thank you. And you're, you are, you are, an awesome teacher. That is very kind, Trevor. Thank you. You're an awesome student too. Ah, next, this one is from Lauren Mack. So Lauren isn't exactly uh, a student or an old student of mine. She's like a family friend. And this is what she says. It's a nice long message. So well done, Lauren. She says, hi, Mr. O. I am a huge fan. Hey, great. I can spend hours watching your channel. That's really nice. Your videos always give me a great laugh. My favourite video is your HK MTR Games versus London Metro. Yes, lots of people like that one. Uh, I had been to London last year, or just, I went to London last year, uh, sorry, last summer, and the Metro there was quite noisy, but I enjoyed every second of it. I made a very short video a long time ago with me on the London Underground, and you can get an idea of just how noisy it is. I'm on the Underground. It's very noisy and quite small. When you have time, please also watch my channel, Mac Lauren Three Two One Go. Maybe you can be my special guest next time. Cheers, Lauren. Lauren, I would love to be a special guest on your channel. That would be my first collaboration on YouTube. Lots of YouTubers collaborate. They get together to make videos. Um, and I will put a link to Lauren's channel in the uh, description just below here. So thank you, Lauren, for your lovely message. I'm a fan of your channel too. Mr. O approves. Next, this one is from Heidi Cam. She sent me two messages, actually. So this is the first one. She says, hi, Mr. O. Did you remember me or do you remember me? I am Heidi. I know you in the BC. And you said you will leave there and be a teacher in a school. Yes, that is true. I think you cannot remember me. Heidi, I do remember you. You made a video about Wimpy Kid and I am there. Yes, I remember that too. If you know who I am, please reply me. Yes, Heidi, I absolutely remember who you are. Thank you for sending me a new message. I always remember my old students and I always miss you. And it's really lovely when you send me a message and get back in contact. And this is Heidi's other message. She says, hi, Mr. O. Now I am P5. When you teach me in BC, when you taught me in the BC, I was P3. Wow. Time really flies. It is great to send you a message. And how are you now? Uh, you said you had a new job in the school before when you teach me, taught me. And it is glad, maybe I am glad that you taught me English. That's really sweet. I think you are the best teacher ever. That is very kind, Heidi. Thank you. You might think as a teacher uh, and as somebody on YouTube that we, you know, maybe we get that all the time. We don't. We don't always have people saying very nice things to us, especially us teachers. And you might think that maybe we get tired of hearing it. I never get tired of hearing it, of course. It's something nice to say. Um, but I think most important, it's really lovely to say thank you and to say nice things to the people who care about you and who help you and who teach you and who look after you. You can always do that. You can always say thank you to your parents, to your teachers, to the doctors and nurses who look after you, especially at times like this. So I had a pretty nice day here in uh, getting some exercise, walking up the mountain, breathing the mountain air, nobody around, so I don't need my mask, but when I go back on the transport, then I will put my mask on. See? Uh, anyway, I will see you next time.